I'm Ricardo Hano, uh, Brazilian, born, working in the United States, uh, more precisely Jacksonville, Florida. I'm a neurosurgeon by training, but I do neurointervention. Uh, I think WNC is a great congregation of uh, very high level uh, neurointerventionists in the whole world. Uh, this is all for me the highlight point of this meeting is that we have an opportunity to share experience and learn from each other, from uh, the Turkish uh, Fantastic Four, uh, from the, our Chinese colleagues, from Dimitrios, from Pedro, uh, from our Spanish colleagues. So it's a beautiful opportunity and very interactive with all the panelists from all over the world interacting and discussing cases and exchanging information. Uh, highlight on the stroke session with Raul Nogueira and Tudor Jovin. Uh, I think it was a, just an all-around great meeting. I think the aneurysm Chicago case was a, a, a great case. Uh, I think uh, my favorite case of the whole meeting was initial uh, AVM embolization. One session taking care of the whole AVM. This is something that is uh, very forefront. There are not many places doing that in the whole world. So to see her doing that in a time span that was like two hours, she shut down the whole AVM uh, with a great result uh, with the patient reportedly doing well. So I think that that is very, very uh, educational for me. Uh, definitely makes me think next time I'm treating a patient that that might be a viable option for this patient. I, I think illustration of new technology is good. Uh, I think the proof comes later. So I, I think it's great to know what's coming around, uh, but I, I think we need, we need clinical data. A lot of those are very early with no patients treated, some of them even before. But I think it's good for the crowd to be aware that there's so much more coming to enhance patient care. Uh, I think from the industry perspective, again, there's so much learning going on and you can see your device, but also you can see what everybody else is doing uh, right there on TV uh, and have the opportunity to ask questions why you're preferring device A versus B and these discussions are happening, happening right there uh, with opinions of 15, 20, 30 high level uh, operators from all over the world. So I think that for the industry is a, is a must, uh, uh, you gotta be here. No, I, I think the, the, the learning labs, I think, is a great opportunity for those that are in an earlier stage of their career to get exposed to technology. Sometimes things that are available in Spain, they're not available in other places that these people are coming from. So they'll have the opportunity to, to learn uh, and even go back to the basics and say why, why you're using this, how you're using this, and so far and so on. Tremendous opportunity.